I hope this is the last time I have to discuss this. After I uploaded my two videos on James Summerton, he made a post on Twitter heavily implying that he was going to take his own life. People started coming out of the woodworks to point fingers at people like me and H-Bomber Guy saying that we took away his livelihood and that we're responsible if he takes his own life. Of course, hearing this sort of stuff thrown at you can be very disheartening, but it doesn't stop opportunists from trying to get attention off of a situation like this. While James has gone silent on his main account since that post, it turns out through recent discovery that he's been trying to rebrand himself on a different account. And the things that people have discovered have been really bizarre. So in December of 2023, when he was first receiving hate, he started an alt account called The Gay Reckenter, which then became Will, which then became The Achillean Boy. It should also be noted that around the same time we were all fearing for James's life, he was making horny posts on this alt account. What the fuck? He was also defending himself against critics of James Somerton under this new identity, which just gives me flashbacks to Misanthropony. After this, he began using TikTok and was using an emoji avatar and an AI voice to make posts. And the straights have gotten their panties in a twist? Being like, what do you have to make everything gay? It's because nothing's gay. We don't even get Iceman in this new series. Now given the emoji's appearance, it wasn't hard to see that it's James, so he dropped the avatar and just started using his regular face. So to recap, James Somerton abandoned his previous YouTube channel after saying he was going to kill himself, leaving all of us in the dark, afraid for his well-being, and then he starts up a new account, doesn't learn anything, and seemingly wants to make the same content under a different name. I also heard that he was posting pictures of his asshole, but I didn't want to look at that. After my last video on James, I questioned why I ever did commentaries. But this video has reminded me why. When you see bullshit, you should call it out. When you see people doing scummy things, you should be a voice. But you need to use it with a level of maturity and compassion. Because then, you're no better than the people you talk about. And with that said, I hope this is the last time I ever have to talk about James Summerton. Thanks to everyone who gave support on my last two videos on James, including Super Brit Bros, which was... Just insane. I'm a big fan of the Michael Lawar channel, so that really made my day. Thank you everyone, and stay safe.